Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Debugging complex C applications can be a challenging task, but with the right tools and techniques, you can streamline the process and identify issues more efficiently. Greg Law, a well-known figure in the software development community, has shared valuable insights into debugging practices. This tutorial will cover some of those practices, along with relevant code examples to illustrate the techniques. Hashtag 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 debugging techniques. 1. Use a debugger. A debugger allows you to inspect the state of your application while it is running. Common debuggers for C include GDB, GNU Debugger, and integrated tools in IDEs like Visual Studio or C Lion. Basic GDB commands. Break function underscore name, set a breakpoint at the start of a function. Run, start the program. Next, execute the next line of code, step over. Step, step into functions. Print variable, print the value of a variable. Backtrace, show the call stack. Example. C. Hashtag includes dot h. Void faulty underscore function, int x. Int result equals 10 slash x, slash slash this will cause a division by 0 if x is 0. Print f, result, percent d backslash n result int main faulty underscore function zero slash slash call with zero to trigger an error return zero to debug this compile with debug symbols bash gccgo app app c run gdb bash gdb slash app Set breakpoints and run the program to inspect where the error occurs. 2. Logging Adding logging statements can help track the flow of execution and the values of variables. Use printf, for simple logging or a logging library for more complex applications. Example C. Hashtag includes do.h Void perform underscore calculation, int value Print F, performing calculation with value, percent D backslash N, value. Slash slash perform some operations. Int main. Int input equals 5. Print F, starting application with input, percent D backslash N, input. Perform underscore calculation, input. Return 0. 3. Static Analysis Tools Use tools like Check, Clang Tidy, or CoveRidey to perform static analysis on your code. These tools can identify potential bugs, memory leaks, and code smells before you even run the program. Example using Check Bash Check Enable equals all my underscore code dot C 4. Memory Management Debugging Use tools like Valgrind to detect memory leaks and invalid memory accesses. Example. C. Hashtag includes dlib.h. Void memory underscore leak. Int asterisk arr equals malloc, 10 asterisk size of, int. Slash slash forgot to free, arr, which leads to a memory leak. Int main. Memory underscore leak. Return 0. Run valgrind. Bash. Valgrind leak check equals full slash app. 5. Understanding and analyzing core dumps. If your application crashes, a core dump can provide valuable insights. You can analyze core dumps using GDB. Example. Bash. GDB slash app core. Use the backtrace command to see the call stack at the time of the crash. 6. Unit testing. Writing unit tests can help catch errors early in the development process. Frameworks like C Unit, Unity, or Google Test can be used for testing C code. Example with C Unit. 
c. Hashtag include c unit slash c unit dot h. Hashtag include c unit slash basic dot h. Int add, int a, int b. Return a plus b. Void test underscore add. cu underscore assert, add, 2, 2, equals equals 4. cu underscore assert, add, minus 1, 1, equals equals 0. Int main. cu underscore initialize underscore registry. cu underscore pseud suite equals cu underscore add underscore suite, test suite, 0, 0. CU underscore at underscore test, sweet, test underscore add, test underscore add. CU underscore basic underscore run underscore tests. CU underscore cleanup underscore registry. Return zero. Hashtag 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 conclusion. Debugging complex C applications requires a combination of tools and techniques. By using a debugger, Logging strategically, employing static analysis, managing memory effectively, analyzing core dumps, and writing unit tests, you can significantly improve your debugging process. Remember that debugging is an iterative process, and patience is key. Happy debugging!